He's a man of great faith and on, um, it's just brilliant, always putting out wonderful uh, kind of uh, theology, really, really good stuff. And so on his dying bed, his friends gathered around him looking. And then as uh, we're coming to death, like things seem to be put in order, put in perspective. We know what's important. We, uh, 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 people report having a very uh, keen sense and awareness of God. And, and Wesley, uh, as they're looking for some last bit of wonderful, just amazing theology, Wesley shouts uh, with his last breath as loud as an 85-year-old dying man can shout, uh, best of all, God is with us. Best of all, God is with us. We were drenched uh, cold. Drench cold, the pouring rain, the howling wind. Uh, we were scared, we were terrified, we were anxious, we were, we were worried about what the next couple of hours would look like uh, until the storm passed when an old Carolina skiff pulled up beside us and threw us a tow rope and uh, pulled us to shore where we can't. I'm <laughs> pretty sure I kissed the ground when we made it. Doesn't matter how hard you run, how opposed you are to God, uh, how lonely you feel, what what sort of chaos you're living through, whether it is literally uh, on a boat in a storm, uh, or whether it's sitting in the hospital room uh, receiving news that's going to change your life, or whether it's staring at a pile of bills on the kitchen table, God is with you. Jesus cares. Will you hear Jesus say this morning to you, I'm with you, and let Jesus speak into whatever your chaos is. Peace be still. And this we say in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, church, one of the most tangible and practical ways that we have to uh, connect with this very real presence of God is through the communion table. And it's that communion that we uh, don't literally understand what happens, but in some real and profound way, God is made present.